Yes to Europe reads their banner. While protesters refuse to leave the streets of Kiev, Ukraine Prime Minister Mykola Azarov says he does not want his country to become a battlefield between the EU and Moscow. Brussels' criticism of Russia after Kiev backed out of a trade deal with the EU has prompted a robust response from Moscow. It was inappropriate, said President Vladimir Putin's spokesman, to speak of pressure from Russia. On the streets, opinions differ. Ukraine is Europe. Ukraine is Europe, and we have to consider ourselves as Europeans. Our culture is closer to Europe. We are fed up with obeying the elder brother Russia for the past 70 years. Until the signing of the agreement with the EU, if this doesn't happen, we're going to change the authorities, and the only question then will be which way to do it. The military way? Because after yesterday's beatings by the riot police, people are ready to fight. It was on Monday night, violence flared around a van that some claimed was an undercover police patrol spying on protesters. Prime Minister Mykola Azarov has confirmed President Viktor Yanukovych will attend the summit in Vilnius with the EU and discuss possible three-way talks on Ukraine's economic problems, which would also involve Russia. Azarov also announced that Kiev would start talks with Russia on reviving economic relations with Moscow in December. We will draw up a roadmap for re-establishing our relations, he said.